Here's a little tip for you. While you've got the copper grease out and you've painted the back of the brake pads with it for lubrication, uh, just put a bit of copper grease on the studs there for the, where the wheel bolts go on and also on this surface area here around the brake drum, brake disc and on that lip there because sometimes you'll find the wheel when it's been on there quite a long time it can actually like corrode itself together and it can be really hard if you're stuck on the side of the road with a flat tire trying to get it off so a little bit of copper grease liberal coating all the way around on that lip and also on the studs and you'll find in future maintenance or if you get a flat tire you won't have no problems trying to kick it off or get underneath the car and trying to beat it off on the side of the road so don't forget the copper grease on there as well and another little tip for you every, every time you change brake pads or you have to push the piston back although you might see when you're pushing it about three or four mil away from the actual disc that can equate to about two or three pumps to the floor an actual brake pedal so whenever you change any brakes or touch the brakes always make sure you pump the brake pedal up to where it should be and you've got a stiff pedal and as I say especially where I am on the hill here you know if I didn't do that I could take the handbrake off go for a test drive and put my foot on the brake and it'll go straight to the floor and then I could just roll into the road or could be pedestrians walking by or something like that but just make sure whenever you touch the brakes always pump the brake pedal and make sure you've got a firm brake before you try and drive the car and then you know you, you can take the wheel off again or check it if not but it'll probably take about two or three pumps to the floor so don't be alarmed by that so keep pumping till you get a pressure there okay thanks bye